Okay, first thing first, this is baby's head. So the baby is head down in position. Okay, that's the baby's head. Oh, she's position now. Yes, in position. Ready to go. <laughs> oh, wow. This is heart. This is her heart. We're going to do the sound. 144 beats per minute, which is normal. And then this is the sound. Beautiful. If I go all the way up here, this up here is the placenta. See how it looks like a little cloud just yes. right here? That's the placenta. And so, like I said, all the way down here is her head. This is the baby's head. Ooh, that's going to be hard to measure because <laughs> it's way down there. Oh, you want, you know what I'm going to, I'm going to show you something really cool. The baby has a lot of hair. A lot of hair? Yes. What do you mean my baby's a lot of hair now? Yes. Head hair? Or... Like on the head, yeah. Okay. Wow. Because mm -hmm. my first baby, um, it's a boy, no hair. Oh. Mm -hmm. No, she has hair. I can see it. Imagine. <laughs> oh, that's cool. It is, it is. I'm going to show you. I'm just doing this measurement and I'm going to show you now the hair. Okay, so what I'm measuring here is the fluid around the baby. And it looks very good, so that's important. But I want to show you, because I was down here by the head, right? Yes. Oh, wow. And then if I go out here, this is this is the baby's, like, the back of the head, like, right here in this part right yes. here. Yes. This is hair. Wow. In that area. You can see, like, the little hair yes. kind of, like, floating. Right? When I look at it from a different angle, look. Yeah. Little strands of hair. I mean, you know, once the baby comes out, maybe it's blonde. <laughs> you can't see it. But that the actual strands, that's yeah. what we're seeing, the actual strands. Some babies have like... Yeah, I can see. She has hair. She has hair. It's so cute. Again, I don't know how I'm going to measure her head because it's so far down. I'm going to have to start getting creative here <laughs> to measure her head. I wonder if she's not moving. I mean, she, you know, she's it's not that she's tight in there because you have good fluid. And I can't even stress how important that is. So I'm very glad to see that the fluid around the baby is normal. You have really good fluid. So because you have good fluid... You know, she there's still space for her to move around, but at this point they're really kind of tight, right? Mm -hmm. So it's kind of hard for them to like move, and so they don't really like jump like they used to before. But it's so nice to see that she's ready, positioned. Yes, she is. This baby saying, "I'm coming out soon, mommy. Pack your bags. <laughs> it's ready. Good, 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 good." See, it's even hard to measure because I don't really have like I'm trying to find a way that I can measure her. Ooh, nice. Okay, so what I'm looking at here is her belly. Okay. So this is the belly right around the waist. Cute. 
keep on trying. Yeah, it looks different now. Before, um, she's kind of small. I know. Now she occupies the whole, yes. the whole screen. It's her, like one body part occupies the entire screen. <laughs> That's how big they get. You know what? I am actually, I'm going to tell you when I'm done, but I'm actually very happily surprised because she's not measuring that tiny. It's just you have a tiny belly. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Like you look tiny because you are tiny. But, yeah, even I eat a lot. Yeah, exactly. But the baby's growing fine, which mm -hmm. at the end, that's the only thing that really matters. fit <laughs> so it goes around this is literally going around her waist okay and now I'm gonna go <laughs> again how am I gonna measure you I don't know little baby I'm like pushing <laughs> It's so cute. Look. <laughs> Let's see that nice. Yes, right? Okay, so I'm gonna measure here. Let's see. Let's measure there. That's her brain. They like that, like the head is positioned. Oh, yes. She can't move it out of there. <laughs> There's only one way to move it out. <laughs> because it feels like I'm here, it's like kicking, and it's hit, and sometimes here. Yes, that makes all, all the sense in the world because her head is really far down. So what you feel up, all the way up here is her legs, arms. Oh, you know. I thought she's rotating. No, no, because see, they, they do this. So her head is down here. So let's say this is her back. She can go like, mm -hmm. can go that yeah, that's not my feeling. Uh -huh. But her head is still going to be down. Oh, okay. Okay. That's good that she's positioned. That's oh, nice. yes, yes, yes. And this is very important that she's head down because if you think about it, like, all this muscles and everything down here at the bottom of your pelvis, they're stretching. Everything is like stretching, getting ready for the baby to come up because of the pressure that she puts with her head. Mm -hmm. So it's actually a good thing. We want the babies to be head down. And that's why like, that's why the doctors say, okay, start walking like 15 minutes, you know, 10, 15 minutes, do little walks here and there. Because it's not even the walking, it's the movement. Like just being in movement helps the baby keep, you know, like going down. Yeah, I keep myself busy yeah. doing something in the house, it's, but it makes me easier to get tired and then... No, no, that's why it's not like long, you know what I'm saying? It's not like, like, ugh, work, you know, hours and hours, no. M movement, 10, it, 15, 20 minutes. It makes me pee a lot. <laughs> Of course, her head is like I don't. Your poor bladder. <laughs> like for example, I just pee now, and then when I go take a shower, I was standing there. I can pee five more. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. This is what I'm saying. Like it's even hard for me to get to her head because I can't go any further than this. <laughs> Does that make sense? Yeah, because. And her head is further than that like her head is more far down than this i cannot i cannot get it so, so that's why i feel like in my you know in front of yeah. vagina it feels like she's ready like she's there she's there she is she's very there and yeah. the way she moves is like it's poking outside yeah but she's inside 
she is inside. She's just like, look, look. She has chunky, chunky cheeks. So cute. She's literally going like this. No. <laughs> I don't know if you can see her face here. It's literally upside down where the forehead is here. The eyes would be here. This is the nose. This is the cheek. Oh. This is the mouth. So like literally her head is doing like at an angle. Because to see her face is really, really hard at this point. They're so far down. They're so like smushed up against the wall. But before I can see everything. Of course, no. Of whole course. body, like, wow. The way she kicks. Yeah. No. Before her little body, like the entire body occupied the whole screen. Yes. Now it's, look, this is just, just the, the head. head. <laughs> <laughs> it's the first time I see that one. Oh, well, yeah. Okay, so I don't want to keep on like pushing and torturing you because there's no point. I did measure the head and the measurement that I got was really good. Mm -hmm. so I think I'm going to leave it like this because I don't want to keep on pushing her up. She's far down, so it's good. We don't want to mess with her. So I want to show you. Look, based on these measurements, she's measuring one week less, which now in the third trimester, that's normal. It's okay to measure one week less. Mm -hmm. Today, she weighs 6 pounds, 14 ounces. Wow. That's almost 7 pounds. And yeah. let's say, for instance, you deliver next... Yeah, she 